health is a window to your overall health and problems in your mouth can affect the rest of your body. Here to shed some light on that topic is Dr. Bobbin Patel of Seaview Dental Arts in Galloway. So sometimes people just don't realize that problems in their mouth or issues with their teeth can affect the rest of their body. How so? Problems can their mouth can issue the rest of the body or if they have problems somewhere else, you can see signs of that in the mouth as well. And the prime example is diabetes. Uh, a lot of patients uh, who have diabetes almost always have some kind of gum disease. They both are inflammatory diseases and research has shown that improving gum disease has led to better control of sugar. And uh, people who have gum disease and diabetes almost always have heart disease because bacteria from your gums are going to go into blood vessels and uh, can end up destroying the heart valves. That's a very important topic and also pregnancy, yeah. correct? Yes. Because of the hormonal changes during pregnancy, uh, women can have something called pregnancy gingivitis. If they already have gum disease, it can be flared up. And research has shown that uh, it leads to premature birth or low birth weight babies. It's very important for us to take care of our oral health. What are some basics? Well, uh, keeping the regular checkups, uh, flossing every day, brushing, and regular checkups so the dentist can look for any signs of infection, may, may it be cavities or large infections. Uh, and oral cancer screening, which is very important. How often should a person go to the dentist? At least uh, six months, uh, uh, every six months, uh, if they can, because they don't have insurance, at least once a year, definitely. All right, very important. Oral health, overall health, definitely connected. Yes. All right, thanks for joining us, Dr. Bob and Patel of Seaview Dental Arts in Galloway. And I'm Robin Stoloff. You're listening to Living Well with Robin Stoloff on Light Rock 96.9 WFPG.